Herman Cain still making ads. First, you know, a bunny was killed. There were goldfish was killed before the bunny actually, and they all had something to do with big government. They were all creepy. There was always this young girl, and, and then Herman Cain's on a out. And so when I heard he had a new ad, I said, "Uh oh, who'd they kill now? Which animal did they kill now?" Turns out there are animals in this, but they're not the ones getting killed. They're the ones doing the killing. If you thought his other ads were strange, wait till you get a load of this. This is the average American taxpayer. This is the average American taxpayer feeding big government. Any questions? Now give it to me, show me Herman. There he is. On the mountain. Or on a cliff. There's some chance Herman Cain is psychotic. I mean, they went from fun crazy to like scary crazy. I hope they don't show that ad on television. I mean, I can't think of a more violent, weird ad that would disturb kids. I can't believe they got a kid in that commercial. That guy was killed and his bones were picked apart by chicken. I mean, it's both funny and so unbelievably crazy that one, you, there are no words for it. Like, what am I supposed to say? It doesn't make sense? Of course it doesn't make sense. Second of all, it's now officially over. There's no question. Herman Cain was never a politician. He's a performance artist. 